vended food that contains all the necessary nutrients for survival. I'm here in John Fideli's kitchen with John Fideli. Hey. Today I'm reviewing the Agfa family camera. And I'm very excited about this. This is a point and shoot camera, a very simple camera to use. It's a camera that takes a Super 8 cartridge. These are cartridges that literally pop in the camera. Easy, easy load, which is why Super 8 filmmaking is beautiful. It's easy, it's awesome. You literally pop it in here, close your door, and... Push a button. Pu yeah, you put, push a button. Look through the eyepiece, and... Some quick things to know about this camera, and there's not much to know. Firstly, it's a point-and-shoot camera. There's nothing to focus on this camera. You literally just look through it, oh, look at that, and you shoot. You load your film cartridge, as I described. You do need batteries. Here's a, it's a look at that. Look, it's a battery tomb. This camera, like most Super 8 cameras, takes two types of batteries, two double A's that run the camera motor, and one 1.3 volt battery that runs the light meter. So you do need to make sure these batteries are nice and fresh for your movie making activities. There is like some kind of shoey thing up top here. Shoey. <laughs> there is. So you could get one of those new light panels that they sell and you could put a light panel on top of this. On this side of the camera, this is where their footage counter is. So when you have your Super 8 cartridge in, you could see as it winds down to zero. Up top here, this is the button to shoot. And this button is if you want to do single frame. Here's a tripod thing. Tripod hole. Yeah. I do get emails, people ask me, well, what about the ISO of the film? You know, how do I know what ISO, and it's, it's just automatic. The camera was made in 1980, and it's designed to shoot ISO 40 or ISO 160 film. Back then, that was pretty much it. I wouldn't worry about it. Don't overthink this camera. Whatever you're shooting, just pop in the cassette and start shooting. That's exactly what I did uh, when I shot at my friend Tom's backyard, and here are some results. Are you a mod or a rocker? Um, no, I'm a mocker. Long drive right field, Good it is. Goodbye. You can find these on ebay.com. Just ask the seller if, if it works. If they don't know if it works, you could ask them to pop in two AA batteries just to, you know, see if the motor is running. That's really it. Till next time, enjoy shooting. And I hope you enjoy your filmmaking. You can send me an email at michael at filmphotographyproject.com if you have any questions. And don't forget to tune into our podcast, filmphotographypodcast.com. And if you're shooting Super 8 film, you could buy Super 8 film right in our FPP online store, filmphotographystore.com. Fantastic. Thank you, John. You don't want to eat from a machine. Look, there's a nice Del Taco across the street. They got enchiladas and everything. But I do want to eat from a machine. <laughs>